uh, incumbent senator who I'll be challenging. Uh, I don't come from privilege and wealth. I've had to come from a background where I've had to work uh, in a lot of manual labor jobs in order to pay for my education and to get spending money for myself. All throughout high school, college, and even law school, I worked in jobs that average Rhode Islanders can relate to. I was a garbage man in my hometown. Uh, I worked as a, a, a floor sweeper, a bagger in a mattress factory. I was a dishwasher. I, I, I took that job when I was uh, in, at Brown. Uh, uh, you may remember at the time, Wheeler was the Wheeler School for Girls. Silly me, I thought by taking that job, it might improve my dating life. <laughs> no chance. <laughs> But the point is that I worked in these things and in these types of employments, and I learned what it means to work by the sweat of one's brow. It's hard work for minimum or little wages. And that, uh, ladies and gentlemen, is something I can identify with. My parents lived paycheck to paycheck. We were not wealthy. I went to Brown on a financial aid scholarship and had to work as part of that. So those experiences have never left me. I know what that's like, and I can identify with folks who have had to struggle. 